The day after Christmas, on a lazy Sunday morning in 2004, unthinkable tragedy hit my favorite place on earth. And it began right here, on the beach where I had come to eat fish and swim. I was 23 years old. A powerful earthquake produced a tidal wave from the Indian Ocean that ripped into the coastal city of Banda Aceh in Indonesia killing 60% of the people in my hometown. 173,000 people died, and many more were lost or injured. Everything was destroyed, except our places of worship. Somehow, by the grace of God, our most survived. In all, the tsunami killed more than 200,000 people. From the United States, to lead American relief, President George Bush recruited two former presidents, his father George H. W. Bush and Bill Clinton. Much of the early effort was dedicated to food, shelter, and the necessities of everyday life. But money raised by President Clinton and Bush also created a scholarship program that sent college graduate students like me to U.S. universities to study, principally at Texas A&M and the University of Arkansas. While roads and houses were being built, this program allowed a few of us to go away for a brief time so we could come home to restore what could not be fixed with asphalt and brick and mortar. My name is Rina Mutia. This is my story, our story, as we strive to rebuild the human capital after the tsunami.